What's up, guys? It's Professor Broman, and today we're going to talk about how to get yourself some splicer tees. Now, I know you're like, but Broman, like, I got one, and, like, I used it, and now I don't know how to get another one. Well, first of all, some good news and also bad news. One, the good news. Splicer keys are easy to get. There's a fuck ton of them. Um, you can carry them, carry more than one, and uh, they, they fly around everywhere. They're easy to get. Second, bad news. Bad news. The drops are random. Um, as you drive around the, uh, uh, the Plague Lands, you're going to notice there's a whole bunch of different kinds of enemies. And every once in a while, you're going to see some enemies that have yellow bars. They're going to be majors. Splicer keys seem to drop off of any major enemy at random. Now, they can drop off of, like, the Brood Mother, who flies around, you know, the little named Brood Mother, or they can drop off of the Splicer Majors that spawn as well. Um, those enemies can also drop another more unique item that you will also want, and you'll definitely need it if you're going to try and start getting yourself a Kavos Dog. Now, that item is this the Splicer Intel Relay. Uh, the Stolen Fallen Relay Cryptic References to Hive Lessers. Now that one, I'm 90% sure, only drops off of the Broodmother, but the Broodmother can also drop the Splicer Keys. Now what do these things do? Uh, the Intel allows you to access a bridge uh, that takes you into the original Cosmodrone from the Plague Lands. Uh, specifically to the area where you first spawned as a guardian, allowing you to go into a fallen catch that is there, grab the Kvostov schematics that are contained inside of it, and then begin the Kvostov quest after you go visit Shiro in the... What is it? What is this? Iron? The iron? The iron? Oh my god, why can't I? Oh, Thelwinter's Peak. Holy shit. Terrible. Start of this public event. My brain turned off. Um, but don't worry. Uh, when we first got them, I was very concerned during my playthrough. I was like, shit, fucking shit. How the hell am I going to fucking get more of these? Are they special? And I used one and I was like, damn it. But no, nah, man, they're actually really, they're really easy to come by. So there you go, guys. That's how to get these splicer keys and these splicer Intel relays inside of the plague lands. Uh, don't worry, there's a little bit of randomness involved, but as long as you're walking around and you're hunting in what is clearly the best patrol area you could possibly imagine, because holy fuck, does, uh, does the Plague Lands just knock it out of the park? Um, nice tracking, good job, bro, man. Uh, you're gonna just get them to drop as they come around. Thanks for watching today, guys. Make sure to rate, comment, subscribe, sp spread it around. And you know what? If you're watching this video, like, you know, five months from now and all the information is wrong, make sure you shit post really hard. <laughs> I love you guys. Thanks for watching. Make sure to rate, comment, and subscribe, and I'll catch you next time in Destiny.